Another four days has passed, and this plant never ceases to amuse and amaze me. It's grown very well, and you know that first pair of true leaves drooped downwards and had the dark purple spots. The others kind of have much lighter purple spots, but you know it's just got meristem activity all over the place. Every you know node all over this plant is just busting out new pairs of leaves in as many directions as possible. And as you can see here. Those look like flower buds, so I'm kind of surprised, but I'm keeping this under bright LED lamp light for around 16 hours a day, so maybe that's simulating uh, very, very long summer hours, you know, that this plant never experiences anyway. So there might be something going on with, uh, you know, a spectrum of these LED lights too that might promote flowering as well, maybe a little bit more red light, I don't know. So this has been very intriguing, but um, you know I just can't wait to see what the flowers look like. And I have a feeling they might, I had a feeling that they might be light blue and that this might be a Ramona lilac, but it appears that they're yellow, which completely throws my thesis off track. So if they're yellow, I, I really don't know what this is. Um, I've never seen any plant like this. This definitely doesn't resemble a weed. It seems like it's destined to grow into a bush. But why would it be flowering less than one month into its life? It just doesn't make any sense. Of course, if you count life from, you know, the seed, it's a continual process. But I'm talking about since germination, since I started wetting this uh, pre-sterilized soil. So if you look at the bottom, you can see uh, pairs of leaves busting out at the bottom, too, where there's no node. So the node is, you know, generally a junction between um, leaf petioles and the stem. So you can see at the very bottom there, there's a small pair of leaves waiting to grow out, which doesn't really make sense.